And finally in sport tonight, a new study of retired NRL players could further change the way we think about concussion. It's revealed a range of brain impairments may manifest later in life. And in tonight's special feature, we take a look at the long-term effects of head injuries. This is the coalface of Australian concussion research. It's an issue right across the board at all levels of sport. Not least for rugby league. Bang! A tough sport where big hits are the norm and the long-term effects poorly understood. Australia needs to be doing a lot more research. Dr Pearce sits on the Australian Athletes Alliance concussion working group set up last year. His latest study seeks to fill the knowledge gap. Mr Pearce tested 25 retired NRL players, all with a history of concussion. The results, alarming. There was a across the board uh, drop in uh, performance in the cognitive and motor uh, tests that we did. This latest study of retired league players focused on three areas of the brain which are particularly affected by concussion. The first of them was the frontal lobe, which is important for attention. The second was the dorsolateral prefrontal cortex, which is important for memory. And the third of them was the motor cortex, which is important for dexterity. Their memory was impaired uh, and also their ability to maintain attention. So trying to stay focused on a task was very difficult. Dr Pearce also used magnetic stimulation to test the retired players' brains. Our brains are working on exciting other nerves but also inhibiting, so it's a balance. And that balance is disrupted, um, particularly with the guys who've had a, uh, a history of repetitive head injuries. Dr Pearce's research is under peer review and will be presented at the World Congress on Brain Injury in the US later this month. He says what's needed now is more Australian data. The players union believe hurdles remain. There's not too many people who want to be the, the pin-up boy or the, the poster boy for concussion. Though with the NRL's concussion policy in its fourth year, attitudes are changing. As we better understand it and we provide improved support, people will be more comfortable talking about it and the impact it's having on their life because clearly that's the most um, compelling education you can deliver. Darren Mara, SBS World News. Yes, a very important message to finish our sport report tonight, Janice. Great, thanks, Tomo.